I'm Bailey Myers. If it's wild, wacky, or weird, from museums to exotic animals, you'll find it on Wild Walks. Endangered Animal Rescue Sanctuary in Citra, otherwise known as EARS. Now it's a really neat place because it takes animals like lions, tigers, and bears that have been neglected or abused and gives them a better way of life. So let's go check out what EARS is doing today. Apart from going to a zoo, I've never really been this close to these wild animals. And let me tell you, they are wild. From little monkeys, to enormous jungle cats. Oh my god. Ears oh my god. takes care of them all. Meet Sarah and Roscoe, two black cat capuchin monkeys who have made ears their home. And like so many of the animals here, these two came to ears neglected. But now they are as friendly as ever. The motto here at EARS is to preserve with dignity. And for Vice President Gail Bowen, she feels that it is her duty to give these animals the respect and love they may have never felt. Every single one of them has their own story. Abuse, neglect, and plain not wanted anymore is normally how we get them. Uh, individuals that don't want them anymore, uh, performing acts, USDA, and the state of Florida places them here. So Gail was telling us that this cougar was just somebody's pet. <laughs> And it's so big and magnificent that it's hard to believe that somebody would just want to take it as a pet and then discard it. For more than a decade, Ears has nurtured and cared for dozens of endangered animals, making it possible for them to live out their lives in peace. Through the healing process, some have even found a bit of companionship. While it's true these animals are left here, I found that they are welcome with smiles, love, and plenty of food. So if you're in the neighborhood and have a few extra paws to spare, check out Ears, a place that runs off of donations and a lot of dedication. And who knows, you might even make a few wild companions of your own.